Hey guys, it's RF the Gordon and Henry fan back again with a 200 subscriber special. First of all, thank you all for 200 subscribers. I really fucking appreciate it. And sorry! I mean, I haven't made more videos, but you know, I'm gonna take short breaks because you know, I'm working on my series and stuff, and I'm also working on another series, the RF the Gordon fan, sh Gordon Henry fan shorts. Right now. So yeah, that's that's why I have been, you know, kind of in the dark recently when it comes to making new videos. I've been working on stuff. But I probably when I make my new when I get my new computer, I'm gonna learn how to like animate and stuff. So I'm gonna you're gonna see some real awesome stuff from me. When I get my new computer and stuff. Like the first thing I want to do with the new computer is make an adaptation of Troublesome Engines. An animated adaptation of Troublesome Engines. And stuff. But anyways. As the 200 subscriber special, I'm gonna show you some stuff I got recently. Um, that I got. First, I'm gonna show you stuff I got from my dad on Valentine's Day, and then I'm gonna show you some stuff I very recently got. First, I got this Thomas game that I played with on my old laptop. I tried to play it on my other laptops, but I couldn't get it to work. But my dad got this for me for Valentine's Day at a thrift shop. That's pretty pretty cool. There's the disc for the game. And uh the cover is this li like little book that tells you how to play the game. And stuff like that. I played it like twice in one day. It was pretty fun. I liked it a lot. So yeah, I quite like this game a lot. It was really awesome. I wanted to get this James game at some point. So yeah. So yeah, if my dad's watching this, thank you for this. I really appreciate it. It was really fun. And uh, here's the back guard behind it. This like game info stuff it looks like. So yeah, that was the Great Festival Adventure. So then my dad got me. And um, something else my dad got me on the same day, Thomas and the Jet Engine. I do have this DVD. Here's the thing. With my other one that I already have, it doesn't have any of these inserts. Let me just get it right now. Also, I'm gonna get the stuff my mom got me on Valentine's Day. Quick, let me just set it down right there, as well as the packaging for it. Here's the copy of Thomas and the Jet Engine that I already have. But here's the thing, I got this when I was really little at like a library. It doesn't have the inserts in it. This does, so that's cool. If you wonder what the inserts are, here they are. Start your kids on a on the right track. Other DVDs you can get slash VHSs. There. That's awesome. This is awesome. Thank you, Dad, a lot. And uh, Thomas and the Jet Engine. Right here, the, the DVD guide. This is the DVD guide for it. And we got this. As Thomas jettled around the island, what did he see? That's pretty fucking awesome. 
And here we have the Iowa Thomas sticker, uh, other Thomas books in the back, other Thomas DVDs slash VHSs. Fun fact, both of these, you'll notice that my other one is a little bit brighter. This one's a little bit darker. I think that's just due to age, though. That's Thomas and the Jet Engine, something Dad got me. So, well, something else Dad got me. It's not Thomas-related, but it's something else Dad got me. So it's Spongebob Season 11. The episode guide. And I haven't watched the new SpongeBob episodes for a while, but a lot of the episodes on here are actually really awesome. Like, Disc 3 has some really good episodes. I really like the episodes on Disc 3. Before I see it, season 11, step in the right direction for SpongeBob. Almost up there with the older episodes, I would say. Here's some gum Dad got me on Valentine's Day. And this gum's actually really rare. And I have opened some packages up, but I'm thinking about keeping one of them in the box, in the packaging. This is one of them. So, yeah. Well, I actually opened up the other two, but this is the one I think I might get, keep wrapped up. Just because I heard this gum's hard to find. That's what Dad said. My Dad said, so. Yeah. Could keep that in the packaging, probably. Something that Mom got me. A Bob's Burgers and King of the Hill figures. Here's the Bob's... Oh, shit. <laughs> Sorry. Here's the Bob's Burger one. I'm definitely going to use this for my... Shorts. And the King of the Hill figure that she got me. On the same day. That's pretty awesome. And uh stuff. She also got me some gum on Valentine's Day. I'm a big gum fan. All plus up uh, Valentine's Day cards and stuff. I also got them, I just don't have them with me. And uh, the stuff that she got me actually has a balloon right here. That's pretty awesome. So, yeah. And, uh, oh. I'm gonna shut up an order when I go. Show that later. Ah, here it is. Oh, fun fact, I actually have character cards for them. I guess, I don't, I don't know if I would call those character cards. <laughs> character cards, just because they're not one railway shit. <laughs> they're taking place shit, but... Anyway, here's something my sister got me. It's actually... A Thomas candy suspenser. Here's the candy it came with. I don't plan on actually eating this candy. I plan on using this for my shorts. Same thing with this. Not saying what. And here's the packaging it came with. So that was cool. I tried to keep it in packaging. So I tried to keep it in good condition. So if I wanted it to keep it in the packaging, I could. So yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's a Thomas candy suspenser my sister got me. A fun fact, even though it has a CJ Thomas, it has a season two-ish looking face. So that's even better. I know you probably can't see it, but it has a... Yeah, you can see it, it has a, like a season two-ish looking face to me. And uh, stuff that... 
my mom's friend got me. I got this thing, a train thing for Despicable Me that they probably got at McDonald's. So yeah, that's cool. And stuff that I'm gonna use for my shorts, like the Sodor Search and Rescue Center. Bush. So yeah, this is pretty awesome. Definitely gonna use this for my shorts. And um this thing, this is cool. This is taking play, by the way. This is cool. It looks like Marin, but if you open it up, it's actually kind of like a play set thing for taking play. There's the mail station and uh, Mace Wave. And here's the dragon. Shit. That's cool. Double using, double using, double using these two for my shorts. There's also some other stuff she got me. My mom's friend got me. Uh, a Tick and Play Thomas, a Snowplow Thomas. This is pretty awesome. I have a little Tick and, I have tick and Play as well. A lot of Tick and Play as well, but this is a nice addition to the collection. I find it hilarious that Thomas looks so happy, even though he hates his snow pile with, like, a burning passion. So that's pretty funny. And, uh, here's a Neville. I already have a Neville, but it's still cool to have, you know, for collecting. I think this is an original Neville, probably, because, you know, I don't think... I know my Neville has a different face, so that's cool to have this. My take and play Neville. I have two Nevels, Trackmaster and a take and play one. Now I got two take and plays, which isn't bad because this one has a different face, which is probably the original face. The, the original face it had when it was first put in stores. I got some track as well. That's awesome. I I had a Misty Island Rescue track. I just don't know where I put it, but you know, it's around here somewhere. So yeah, I forgot one more thing. Let me just get that. Oh, here's my giant rescue track I was talking about. I got Trackmaster 2 Thomas. This is pretty awesome. If you're wondering, this belonged to my mom's friend's son. Not gonna say his name. But yeah. A good friend of mine as well. I went to visit them with my mom and sister a few days ago. So that's uh, Thomas. I don't really like the Trackmaster 2 Thomas because it doesn't free will. That's what I don't like about the new Trackmaster stuff. It doesn't free will. Free wheel. But. So, it looks nice, what Thomas does. Anyway, the old ones are way better, though. I plan on turning this into either a channel icon or a 75th special Thomas. That's what I plan on doing with this. So, yeah. That's basically all the stuff I got recently, Thomas, related or not. That was my 200 subscriber special. And I plan on using this for um, my shorts. And, uh, yeah. I already got some people to help me with my other series. My main series, Thomas is Gone, but these are here. Or Thomas is Gone for short. Thank you for watching. Have an awesome day.